Let's learn how to use the powerful NLA editor. The NLA or nonlinear animation editor is, in my opinion, the most underutilized power feature of Blender. It lets you take an animation action and offset when it plays, repeat it, increase or decrease its speed, place multiple actions in sequence, or even layer and blend them together. In the animation tab with a character spawned, let's say you put together the world's best walk cycle, a two-step walk in place. Let's flip this window into a dope sheet editor and turn this bottom one into an NLA editor. And the dope sheet editor, consider switching from dope sheet, which shows the whole scene, over to the action editor, where you can specifically manage single action data blocks such as our two-step walk cycle. Please go ahead and name the action walk cycle. In the NLA editor, your editing action appears as this orange layer. We need to push this into an NLA strip. Now as a strip, all of the Blender shortcut keys apply, including G to grab, S to scale up or down, i.e. changing the speed, Shift D to duplicate, and X to delete. Let's repeat this cycle. Select the clip, then press N to make sure the side panel is open, and go to strip. Yes, lots of settings, but don't worry. Just expand the action clip and increase the repeats. Nice, but uh, we're still walking in place here. Let's add motion to our root bone. You'll notice that adding keyframes automatically creates a new action, once again visible as an orange editing layer in the NLA editor. Push that down to another action strip. What if we wanted to adjust the torso of the walk cycle all hunched over like? Welp, just make a single keyframe at any point in time with the torso in that position, push it down, and then you might need to make a new NLA layer and change the start and end frames to match your scene. At first, this might already seem good, but if we temporarily disable the other NLA layers, we see that we lost the walk cycle's vertical bobbing. So let's change the blending from replace to combine. Nice, now we've added a sort of adjustment animation layer. What if we want to wave and nod our head during the walk? Well, consider again turning off all the other animation strips and create a new action, animate with the minimum set of bones possible, the arms and head, and again, push it down to a strip and re-enable the other NLA strips. Once more, we set this to combine, but this time let's also set extrapolation to nothing so it doesn't affect future frames. And let's add frames to the blend in and out to avoid any snapping. Oh, hi, Mark. Ah, but want to edit the keyframes of a strip? Just select it and with the mouse over the NLA window, press tab. You can now edit the keyframes in the dope sheet like normal. Exit with tab or go to edit, stop tweak menu item. Now we're walking. And there you have it, multiple layers of animation with reusable action strips. Next up, learn to animate faster with pose libraries.